不论你我可曾相识，无论在海角，在天边。I will use this opportunity to blah 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 and chat about something that I do not understand. So, <clears throat> uh, I was just clicking around. Yeah, I'm sorry I waste so much time on the internet. And I found one video of one guy making coffee and uh, that is something that we do not need to waste our time on but one thing that I found interesting is that he put butter in the coffee and uh, then I started search and it linked to a lot of other video with the same nature. Then I found one word, and it's actually a food trend. A very, 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 very trendy trend. That uh, <clears throat> people drink coffee with butter. Try to imagine it. Well, if you understand, this is nothing nothing new or something but for me it's kind of it's hard for me to imagine at the beginning and uh, still it's hard for me to imagine at the end that people drink coffee with butter they do not put milk no cream no milk no sugar and put butter and it's not uh, whatsoever butter, 
it has to be one particular kind. And also they put something, oil or something, anyway. So it is called bulletproof coffee. And um, it's quite uh, interesting to see people that uh, goes into so much extreme in, in doing things. It's not necessarily extreme that uh, people each have uh, an interest in doing something. And, uh, they make it big, they make uh, something out of it, they make a, a statement on a voice on it. I do not think I will do that, but uh, just uh, share with you, share with you this new, um, new finding. For a lot of you, maybe it's not even a new finding. And the theory behind it is uh, that uh, our body needs fat and needs good fat instead of uh, not so good fat. They drink in straight this good fat. What do you think? What is your knowledge on it? I, they, they, they make the coffee and then blend the butter into a hot coffee and something else. And, uh, and then they become very energetic and feel good. I think People like me, who does not need those things, are very fortunate in the end. We do not need to eat special food, special things to energize us, and just uh, normal, inexpensive things is sufficient for us. We do not need to go into this, that particular trend to spend more money or to just to to make us feel better. We can be naturally be good. It's a, it's a very fortunate thing that we have we have this fortune, it's a, it was a millet. To be healthy and to be, to be healthy and to, to not to need a lot of expensive things is actually a fortune. Because you can save those monies for doing things that you're passionate about. You can, you can be passionate about something that is totally off the grid, totally totally unimaginable to others, but uh, you just passionately love about it. You can love reading, drawing, something more destructive, something more fun, swimming, running, they are all good things. Making up, new clothes, Camera, photography, cutting paper, design, designing a new car, passion about inventing. You can save money for all this. Anyway, anyway, anyway. Anyway. Um, I would like to hear your idea, experience on this bulletproof coffee thing. If you have any experience and uh, you're passionately about it and uh, you are passionately love it or dislike it, share some of your experience or knowledge. It's not for me. I 
do not think for now I do not think I will do that I will not put coffee put butter in my coffee it's against my it's against my thought but maybe having some knowledge on it doesn't hurt we can be just as happy by being happy we can be just as energized by being energized bye bye friends if you care to share some of your knowledge